I think this is our eighth showcase. So, uh, so I've been, um, I sort of the, this unit was really it had an earlier lifespan and then it kind of was dissembled. Okay, so about eight years ago, I was asked to be the director, and then we switched from being teaching and learning services to the center for teaching and learning. And I'm a party kind of person, come from New Orleans, and to me, if you cannot celebrate, then what's the point? <laughs> I mean, you know, you want to, you have everyday life, you have things that are disappointing, things that are challenging, but you also want to be able to talk about the positive. You know, there's not that many people say, you're doing a great job, you know, day in, day out. It's more like once a year, you're doing a great job, and other days it's like, well, couldn't you give me this? Could I have that? You didn't make that clear. You get, we get kind of more negative, and I think the faculty in the trenches really, they get probably five times more negative feedback on a day-to-day -day basis, or could you give me this? Can you help me with this? So one of them is that you're not alone, right? We all have these challenges that we, we have to face, and, and the second part is, and there's a lot of people that can help you. We decided that, you know, I mean, the first year was kind of a pull, you know, going from creating programming from, you know, almost nothing, because we'd had a year with almost nothing. And, you know, I thought I got to meet a lot of people, and there was really so much that was really great that was going on. I wanted to have a venue for it, and a local venue where almost everybody who wanted to tell us what they were doing that was working, that they got to tell us. And, you know, I think you could see today, too. You sometimes hear about people who are angry or frustrated or afraid of change and I think it's important to have a venue where you can say that. I love going to these things. Um, they're, I already found a tool that I want to use from my computer science colleagues out here uh, that I'm going to want to use next year in the intro course and in fact I now have a goal of integrating it into a tool that we use downtown. Every time I come to one of these, I find an application or an idea that I come away going, I really got to try this next year. My favorite is when two people who didn't know each other get together and go away planning to do a research project together. And it doesn't happen often, but when it does, I think that's exactly why we have these. One of the challenges as an administrator that I am finding is that I actually get to be privy to and, and get to interact with the longer term plan. like looking at possibly upgrading or replacing Blackboard um, and hearing all the different opinions about what that might mean. It makes me so proud to be part of U of T. You know, it's yeah. like, you, it's such a, it's a microcosm of the world. I, I, I mean, you know, it's like, if, there, if, if that idea's out there, there's probably somebody at U of T that's trying it. It's just like amazing how you can go to what pretty much is conceived of as a campus conference, find yeah. colleagues that might, you know, not be more than 20 yards, from where you would normally be operating that you had no idea what they were doing and they're doing something that you're really interested in and thinking you were going to have to go to you know across the continent to to find out about yes. right we kind of get into our own place and that and we forget that this is just i mean that's what i love about universities that the people tomorrow you know they're the day tomorrow but then they're back in you know you move around or we like we govern ourselves and that's yeah. it's it's really kind of fabulous but you know so those are the, it was a bit shocker for me. I'm kind of more like a peanut gallery kind of person. Yeah. Right? <laughs>